Okay, greetings everyone. This is First Centurion, 753, with the next episode of uh, Victoria 2, um, USCA. We're going with Chilean Conquest Part 2 here, or Part 2 of the Chilean Conquest. And uh, we've expanded the conquest into uh, Atacama. If I said that, I should have looked it up before I did this. Um, this province has sulfur, which is critical to, I believe, explosives. Ooh, I wanted to check out. We are tropical wood, right? So let's see who is uh, who produces the most tropical wood. Ah, damn. I was hoping we get on that. 75, the Netherlands, and we produce 49. Yeah, I don't know we're near as good as the Netherlands in the tropical wood. Thought we could have gotten the top five in one of the producer columns. That would have been nice. Nice thing to have. Sulfur sign them in, and we are working on it. Um, we're working on grabbing some. What else do we produce? We produce a lot of lumber? Really? That's surprising, and we trade off a lot of lumber. Huh. Definitely not in the top five. But, lumber. Look at this. 10,000 people here. Oh, I can't build new factories. What stupid government do I have here? Conservador. That sucks. What do I want? I want state capitalism, right? Or intervention? No, no. Intervention. I want the Nationalista Party. I want my Nationalistas. Or these. I don't think I want these. These are too extreme. Where's my Nationalista Party? When's the next election? 1901. Yeah. I want to build like, uh. Like furniture? You good with that? This needs lumber. See, that's the thing that sucks about this one. You can't, like, see what you need. I think there's a way to do it. Is there a way to do it? Show factory rely on lumber. There's no way to look at it. Which factories need lumber? I guess it doesn't matter because you can't produce any factories, anyways. I don't think either one of these need lumber. But explosives, I think, does need sulfur. Which is why let's go ahead and invest in the sulfur factory. Booyah, at least we can do that. And let's invest in we're at 32,000. Let's invest in the cement. And let's go ahead and invest more in railroads. Fiji Railroad, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, all projects fully funded. Press play, see what happens. Decision, naval decision making. 93%. They are occupying us down there at 11%, but nowhere near. Right there. International crisis. See, that's why I want to be involved. Ottoman Empire. Romalia. We got a victory. Where's this? Oh, that was not. Victory at sea? Or victory there? It's liberated. No attackers there. 51%. 16%. We can't grab. Let's see, we can add another war goal real quick. Naval organization, very good. Uh, 19. So humiliation is 3. And would give us 5 points on prestige, which will put us in 180. That helps. I'm going to go with that one. Proceed. 22. That's it. No more war goals. Naval supply range. Let's expand it. And. Booyah. This is over. 14. 9 more percent. We're going to call for a peace treaty. Oh, I have to wait. October 4th. It's coming. Send it. They would not accept. Oh, you jerks, why not? 
121. Wow. Alright, I'm just gonna go move into these provinces. Okay. 121. We're gonna have to take out this navy. Capture the capital will probably gain a good amount, right? Seventy-two percent liberation there. Independent command, naval organization, plus one. The good thing about this is when you defeat the uh, rebels, uh, you maintain their occupation progress. So we're gonna wait on that for a little bit. Booyah there. Oh, no, 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 no. Did I get that right? Okay. Send this fleet right there. And then we'll move to occupy the fleet, and then we'll take them out via the ironclads. Ironclads got two ironclads there. No way they have any ironclads. I doubt they have any ironclads. War goal being achieved should likely have improved our points. Sixty-three percent pointage. War score. Sorry, war score. Attack your occupation is thirty-four. Fulfilled 100%. That's at uh, 21. Yeah. Alright, that's making progress, I think. Oh, is it ready? Are they ready? I don't want to accept their offer. What are they offering us? No, no, no. I want the whole thing. I want it all. 71. 50 points away. Battles are at 9. Blockades are at 0.7. That's nothing. Occupations. Attack occupations are 34. 22 for acquiring of Los Rios. 5 for acquiring of uh, Chilean Atacama. We're going to take their capital. Another battle. Victory. Uh oh. But we're winning anyways. Because the ironclad. One ironclad is enough to knock out all the men of wars. Should be a big win, hopefully. Trade good change to rubber. Hmm. Oh, that's probably tropical wood. Ah, oh, we lost a tropical wood. Did we? Two points on that victory, on that naval victory. It's not bad. All right, we're looking good navy-wise. Army, that's a little weak. There's no fortification. Let's get army. Then we build forts if we need to. I don't know if I want to or not. I don't have the money for forts. And after that, we're going to refocus on like navy or culture or finance or something like that. Speaking of finance, let's pay off this loan. Repay the loan. Repay the whole thing. Get rid of that interest payment. Oh, it's frozen. 26 bucks. That's big. And we're fully funding everything. Almost everything. Make a lot of money. Let's reduce the tariffs a little bit. 20%. Alright, take out these guys. Where are we at now? 2% steel production. 87 war score. Take the capital. No more blockades to be had here. 
We could move against Uruguay or Paraguay. Those are options. Where's Paraguay? Paraguay, Paraguay. Paraguay is over there. We have to be able to move through Argentina. That disappeared. Um... Ninety-two still won't accept. Let's talk to Argentina. Zero. They will accept military access. Very good. Very good. Now we can invade Uruguay and Paraguay if we need to. First, we'll move north and take out those. Well, I could dispatch one arm. Oh, I gotta move through. Yeah, it's all Argentina. Okay. Ninety-eight. Occupation is at forty-two. Beautiful. No, I want the whole thing. Oh wait, go back. Um. Hmm. Oh, we want this one immediately. That'll give us huge, enormous prestige bonuses. Huge. If we get them first, if we get those discoveries first. That will ensure that we stay in secondary power because we fell to 15th already. Not good. We need those big prestige scores there if we can get them. We're going to analyze that when the war is over. Mass culture and avant-garde. Ninety-three thousand two. We're making a ton of money. Lower the tariffs. We get good trade goods in. Run the factories. Okay, now we occupy almost everything here. Empirical interdiction reports. Check this out. Pose peace. Hundred. Mm. Alright, we're going to have to detach here. Let's send the minor army north, occupy Jose, and the uh, main army will go for Uruguay. Okay, game on, baby. Right across the Argentina plain. Argentina... That's not a plane. Mountains and plains. Plata. La Plata Plata, isn't it? Is that it? What is it called? I don't remember. September 5th? September 7th or 8th. Okay. War has expanded. Field fortifications. Very good. Factory costs. Reduction. I like that. Alright, alright. We can speed things up maybe. I'm really fast. Ooh, rebellions. Anarcho liberal re rebellions. In Argentina. Ooh, they got a big army. Alright, this occupation should go quickly and then we'll take the capital. Are you giving us everything? No. Beat it. Jerks. I want everything I asked for. Permanent prestige. Karl Marx, one point. How we looking? A hundred still, huh? There's another point. Victory. Tax efficiency, double standard. Uruguay, Uruguay and army is trying to re retake the territory. Not gonna happen. We got a reform going here. Oh boy, look at this. I like uh, trinket minimum wage. 7% of population wants that. What is a big number here? Not a lot of reform desire. Oh, that's the best one. Schools. Reduce that movement. Common school movement. Let's go ahead and take that out. Take an acceptable school system. Because that gives us 3% immigrant uh, attraction and 15% education efficiency. Booyah! I always go education first. It's my priority. 
It's my forte. <laughs> okay. We're gonna, yes. Walk right through there. Sweep right through there. Take out the army. No way, Uruguay. You're not getting out of this. The only one that can save you is Argentina. And they need to accept the... F Why can't they accept the whole thing? It's annoying. Peru. Peru sneaking in there. I don't think it's so, Uruguay. Why is this not increasing? Should be way over a hundred. Rubber, more rubber for us. Looks like Paraguay is occupied by somebody. Is that Argentina? Yo, what the heck? Why can't I get the whole thing? Well, they would accept it. Oh no! Oh, damn it. That's not what I wanted. Damn it. Ah. Okay, slow this down. Slow down. Moving too quickly. Where's my army? Occupy. This has got to be it. I mean, there's nowhere else. After you conquer that, it should be over. Eighty-five. Eighty-eight. Eighty-nine. Eighty-nine percent. Come on, baby. Ninety. Ninety-one. I'm gonna talk to them. I'm gonna occupy this thing, and then I'll talk to them. percent that's it this is really annoying why is it not a complete victory because this stupid jerk Rejected the offer. Hmm. I'm going to go with liberals in the upper house because I want reforms. Where else can I... Oh, is that one? No, that's not it. What is that? Bolivia. This is not a full conquest. What, is, what am I missing? Do they have territory here? No. No. It's gotta be a complete victory now. You gotta be kidding me. What else can I do? That's gonna hurt me, like, uh, with prestige if I only accept that. I don't know what else I can do. Peru snuck in there and grabbed that. Paraguay? Has Paraguay left? Let's take Paraguay. Collections are starting. 
the only thing I think I can do. One, two, three, four, five provinces, I think. Combined, they could, should go pretty quickly. Okay, I want to take a look at this, but um, we're at about 20 minutes, so I'm going to end this episode here. And we will uh, continue in the next one. Um, thanks for watching. Hope everyone has a great day. Um, please like the video if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more and you haven't done so already. Hit the bell button, and you can also support me on Patreon in the link in the description down below. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.